Okay, so I'm gonna do this in one take. This is already amazing feature of Ventura. If you haven't used it, you can organize your screens like this. One thing that I've been finding really annoying is if you have a group of apps, they just shrink to the same screen automatically. So for example, if I go to this desktop, um, I have some notes open here and they all kind of go into the same stage. But what I would really like to do is have one note next to the other note and then, you know, have these in their own stage and then have these in their own stage. So it's kind of difficult to separate two notes next to each other, two windows from the same app. According to the official Apple documentation, what you're supposed to do is drag it back to the thumbnail area. Um, I don't know what that means. If I try and drag this back to the thumbnail area, it doesn't do anything. So not sure what that means, but I'll tell you what the answer is. Say I want to make a new group with just two notes. I click it and put it there. So now, I am so lost. I, I just forgot while I was recording this video how to do it. This is a bit unintuitive, I would say. I just I just want a stage with these two windows. To create a group of windows in the center, drag a thumbnail to the center window, or press shift key while clicking the thumbnail. So they are still in the same. Okay, it looks like what you have to do is open the notes. Okay. And then shift click on drag the first note out that you want. So I want that note. Okay, now we go back to the other notes that I want, and then I want that note. Okay, now we've got a scene. So now when I shrink these, they're gonna go into their own scene. And do, do we have it yet? Can we please have it? I think this is, I think we're, I think we're getting close. Uh, shift click on that. And we have two scenes. I think I know what's going on. I don't know what that option does. I still, I still don't know what that option does. Hot ones. What? No way. <laughs> I can, no. How did no one tell me about this? Oh my God. Is this for real? I've been, I've been doing control command Q this entire time and I could just have a hot corner. Uh, yes, please. So I think I would like to have a hot corner for lock screen for sure. And I think I would definitely like to have a hot corner for, hmm, not launch pad because that's just a mess. Desktop for sure. And are people still using screensavers? I would love to know what that is for. Probably for notification center, I guess. So does that mean, oh, <laughs> that is cool. I just go, what? <laughs> that is incredible. Just, just as I was doubting Apple's design. Do I want notification center that accessible? What does application windows do? Oh, interesting. This is very interesting. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. I'm, I'm okay with, with counting this as day of the review. That's fine. I don't even care about stage manager anymore. This is, this is so good. No, I've, I hate the setting. I hate the setting so much and there's a way to turn it off. The hot corners I'm going to have are going to be probably desktop. I, I like to be able to go to desktop quickly all the time. Notification center is something I use a lot, but also found it already distracting. Should I do a screensaver? Would that be good? Okay, I think that's cool because there is something nice about like if someone walks up behind you, then you just put it in the screensaver mode. And I said this was going to be a single take. What I already meant is it's going to be 10 takes and take me three hours to edit. So there, there is, I mean, what I've discovered is that desktop and dock is very cool. The, the only difference this makes is that if it's on all at once or one at a time, the only difference is that if I click here, it's going to show both of these instead of cycling through them. So this is all at once, one at a time. It should show us, <laughs> I assume that was going to show it to us one at a time. The real question is how do we group? Oh, when you do it on one at a time, it just toggles. That's kind of nice. I think this is the answer. I think this is what we're supposed to do. Besi besides for the fact that I think this documentation is already bad, we're supposed to click to expand our windows and then open one of them and then click to expand again, then shift click to open the next note. And now we have two notes next to each other. I think the key here is to, is that we don't shrink 
any of these. So now to create the stage, what you actually have to do is just click anywhere else. So just like click here and then they go down. And now if we open notes again, you, we should see that those are grouped and they are grouped. And if I open this note now, it's going to be in its, it, this is going to create a new stage. And if I click to expand this, drag this note out in front. And now we should have, if I click away to go back to stage manager, we should have two groups here and we do. So now I can switch between these and Spotify and then switch between these and Spotify. And that's what we wanted to do. So what's the difference between put display to sleep and lock screen? 